Welcome to Zero Page Homebrew, your best source for the newest Atari games, and today is Jaguar Day. Rawr. Do the math. There we go. Jaguar's up. Ding. We have four homebrew today, including the brand new Jaliga. Nice. Uh, and you can imagine uh, what port Ooh. it is, what to game, what game it's made. Uh, it is a port of Galaga! Yay! Yes, so I'm very excited about that. Mm -hmm. um, we're also going to be exciting. playing a La Bé de Mort uh, yes. for the Jaguar. Nice, nice. Um, also, classic Kong Complete and Burger Time. Okay. Some little bit older ones, okay. but uh, I haven't played them on the show before. Excellent. So, the cats are excited, oh, as they always are. Oh, this black cat is... Attacking my foot. Yeah, losing his mind. Homebrew can be used both singular and plural. Mm -hmm. That's, I think so. I think it's a... Homebrew or homebrews? I have five homebrew games up there. Now, I wouldn't say I have five homebrews games up no, there. No, I would say brew, but... But you can, I think you can also add an S. There are five homebrews, but you can't say homebrews games. But you would say home... Yeah. Yeah. So uh, both ways, but I usually say homebrew. I usually five say homebrew. Five homebrew. Interesting. Yeah. Yeah. I usually hmm. don't pluralize it. Yeah. Uh, but I do want to thank the Twitch subscribers who are scrolling mm -hmm. beside Tanya there. Alan the Fur, Armscar Coder, and Atari Night 74, Atari Age, Atari's Maximus, Beef Supreme, Bear, Poker, Bu Buffalo, Pinball, Charles, Stony Mao, Charles Willing, Chitlala, Cole Patch, Colonel Ava, Cubitismo, Dino, Identify, Drexel, Dark Mook, House, Gamma, Dev, Glenn, Main, Great Defender, Ground Trooper, Your Rapper, Johnny W. C. Capito, Caputo, Kenzo, uh, Carl G. Ken Jennings, Vader, Kev, Kelly, Kveltifer, Lambda Express, Learn DTZ, Mark Yannis, Mark Space, Sig, Metal Atari, Mick Muse, Mike Soul, Mike the Down, Miss Command, Mike K. Smith, Mother 3, Mr. Zarn, Mr. Fake, Buddy, Funster, Nostalgic, Pack Ravage, E. Koog, R. R. Raymond, CRC70, Render, Ghost, Repentless, Fiji, Gorkado, Pimps, Ledge, Hammer, Smitty B, Sunny Square, Esmeralda, Teleprompter, Tiki Down, KT, Foes, Track, Committee, VVG, Double Down, X, Ken, X. <sighs> Almost got the last one. I had to take a breath. Uh, if you want to support <laughs> the show, you can. It's free with Amazon Prime, just like uh, Sprite is trying to, but you can mm. only meow. Um, or you can do like <laughs> Buffalo Pinball did just before Yay, the show. Thank you, Buffalo Pinball. Thank you so much. And you can keep these cats fed with the treats yes. that we're inevitably going to give them today. Yes. Um, I do have a poll question before we get into the news. Um, I watch repair videos. Yes. Uh, um, mm -hmm. of consoles and also, um, computer, old computer systems. Mm. Um, and quite, they quite regularly, quite regularly. <laughs> it's like we're gonna move this capacitor, yeah. replace it. I'm capacitor. usually sitting there going, Let's How do this. long Let's do some... is this video? <laughs> oh, it's only an hour. He's just gonna do continuity tests for an uh, hour. Can you put it on like four <laughs> times <laughs> speed? <laughs> um, anyway, they, I hear them refer to uh, disk drives all the time, mm. and they're saying it about various things. And I was like, that's mm. not a disk drive to me. So I was wa wondering what everybody what thinks a disk, a disk drive. drive is. Uh, is it a floppy drive? Is it a CDD, CD, DVD optical drive? I'm really two. curious what people Is say. it a hard drive? Or is it a generic name for all of them? For everything. Yeah. Um... Because they all have discs. They all have platters. Some are floppy. Some are hard. Interesting. Yeah. Um, when I said, if, if, if all three were on a table, yes. and I said, can you hand me that disc drive? I would say, do you mean the floppy drive or the DVD drive? Because I've called DVD drives disc drives if it's on a computer. Disc drive, yeah. On a computer. On a computer, yeah. Yeah, not if it's like a DVD player. But if it's an optical drive, I've called that a disk drive, I think. Disk drive, yeah. However. No, SSD doesn't have a disk, so. <laughs> what about SSD? Doesn't count. <laughs> I don't think I've ever referred to a hard drive as a disk drive. I've never, I, I would it's call a it a hard drive. drive. I wouldn't drive. call it a disk drive. Hmm. So I think I have used disk drive for a DVD drive on a computer. Like, but I've never said optical usually drive, I only think when I'm floppy. being specific. I think only floppy, mainly floppy, but I think I've probably used the term. So I, uh, I've, I've definitely never used mm. it for CDD, DVD. 
Optus drive. Or I've never called the C D DVD an optical drive though. Even that's no, no, their no, official no. name. No, I know that's a DVD optical. I'm just referring to disc it that drive. way, but I think I've called it a disc drive can on a computer. The, can you put the DVD put in the, the disc, disc drive? Put the disc in the disc drive. Put the disc in the disc drive. Yeah. Okay. Put yeah. the disc in the disc drive, but put the DVD in the DVD player. I wouldn't call it a drive. Have you said put the floppy in the disc drive? Yes. Definitely. Have you definitely said Oh, we need, we've run out of room on the disk drive. Never. We need to upgrade Hard it. drive. Always a hard drive. <laughs> Always a hard drive. Always so I'm going to go drive. one and two for me. It's hard. Is that, but oh, not, are you saying the same as me? One and two, but yeah, not three. Yeah, just, just like <clears throat> working through it. I wonder Definitely if. Definitely not three. I wonder if where you're from impacts. Oh, 100%. The terms 100%. you're using. Yeah. Because <clears throat> th this also relates to. Um, yeah. Cartridge or cassette in some areas of the world they actually used a cassette for one of these not many i don't know anybody who ever referred to this as a cassette but it looked Ooh. like a cassette tape yeah. it looked like an eight track cassette tape Discount. to some people some yeah. you know parents back then would be like oh i got you a di uh, a cassette for yeah. your atari 2600 um yeah, I thought it was a floppy disk compact disk, and I would have said a compact disk drive. Oh, compact disk drive. So yes. I would have called it a disk drive. That's right. So I, I think for me, one and two, but not Disquette, three. 100%. Diskette. And a lot of the, the packaging yeah. is labeled diskette. Diskette. I like it. Oh, thank you for yeah. subscribing, Neomedia. Yeah. Ding. Brock Hassler says in, in Chile, you know, uh, 2600 cartridges there were we called go. cassettes all the time. So it's, uh, yes. there is it definitely is regional. a local, regional kind of definition. Yes, five and a quarter diskette goes, goes in the, the disk drive. drive. Yes. Mm, okay. Yep. yep. I just called it a CD drive. Yep. Or DVD drive. I would call it that. Yeah. I've Laser called it disc. a disk. Compact disk drive, though. I've compact it, disk? Yeah, disk drive. The full the full name i don't know i'm from ontario what so do you want to tell me like what do you want <laughs> yeah from another part of the country that is so. the full name cd compact, disc compact disc. Disc. cd drive yeah, yeah. yeah. i really don't Ooh. hear disc drive anymore no not really anymore but the repair shows say it all the time really they're usually referring now i'll tell you to the floppy drive because that's what's on most yeah. old systems they uh, hard drives didn't really come into play, and CD and optical drives didn't yeah. really come to play much later. Well, it's it was raining, raining hard. Um, yeah. Much later, after you know these repair shows, they're doing these things. It's older stuff. Jazz now drive. everyone's just just dis naming drives, naming drives in the chat. <laughs> naming zip media. drives, jazz drives. We had jazz drives at work for a while. That's funny. Yeah. I had zip drive. It failed, and I went forget I Omega. We're done. <laughs> Nostalgic. You and I are done. Bits and bytes to get the authoritative answer. Yes, bits agreed. And bytes. Oh, yeah. I let I watched that Micro a lot. Micro drive. Yeah. yeah um so let's see who's i in still the know the theme song to that too yeah i can i can hear it's it in my head digital. Do, 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 yeah. do, something like that bits and bites we didn't get that over here information <laughs> da, i don't know all the words anymore da, 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 we da, had those da. people yep. that heavily promoted future shop on their show i can't remember who they oh. were they're still doing it some form of the show i think they're on youtube i think i know who but they were complete shells for uh oh, <laughs> yeah. for future shop or whatever they yeah. like all they did was like one store and they disguised it as like a tech show yeah i can't remember billy van the yeah. man <laughs> larry's house of frankenstein mm. frightenstein frightenstein that's yeah. james's that's yours your favorite grew up on that I'm oh my god so good place here sorry that's why, I, that's why I always put this pillow in my lap. She's having drinking problems. It's for cats and spilled drinks, <laughs> so I don't end, end up with them all myself. Yeah. Um, I should ask my gems yes. and children. Mm -hmm. Okay, so in first by far. What's a drive, Carl? What's a drive? What's a drive? It's all digital. <laughs> it's man. all in the cloud. 70. What's wrong with my glasses? What's wrong with my eyes? 76.5% floppy drive. Floppy, yeah. Uh, yeah. And then second place, 17% generic. <laughs> Um, and uh, third play, CD, DVD, optical, and nobody thinks it's a hard drive, which is... No, I, I wouldn't call You're it right. a hard drive, yeah. You're absolutely You right. are correct. <laughs> um, um, so, uh, there is a hullabaloo today about uh, oh. a news story. Oh. About a new Atari 2600 game that's coming out Oh. Uh, for pre-order on July 31st. Okay. And it's less about the game. Okay. 
It's actually nothing. My the what game I'm is talking fun about, kind the, of thing. The game has nothing to do with what I'm going to talk okay, about. Okay. 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 It's, it's a 2600 game. Okay. It looks fine. Yeah. I haven't played it. I've yeah. only watched a video of it. So okay. let's let's look at the game first. Okay. To get that out of the way. Okay. It has nothing to do with the game. <laughs> just so uh, just so people know. Um, here it is. Yes. I saw someone. And it's called Mr. Run and Jump. Here we go. And it's from our friends at Atari. <laughs> uh, Mr. Run at Atari. Uh, Atari. Atari, the company Atari. Okay. The the IP holder Atari. Yeah. Um, so it's Mr. Run and Jump 2600 limited edition for sixty dollars, mm. or you can pay in for interest free payments of fourteen ninety nine. You should not be buying this game if you are paying in four four installments hey. of fourteen ninety nine. Hey. hey. No, you shouldn't. <laughs> You really shouldn't. Okay. If you're financing an Atari cartridge, <laughs> don't do it, people. Pay, pl play, buy something else or save <laughs> up for it. Um, okay, arcade uh, arcade platforming action returns to its roots with an exciting announcement. It's the unveiling of an Atari 2600 version uh, of the recently revealed adventure platform, Mr. Run and Jump. The official release marks a significant milestone sure steeped in retro history the first cartridge launch launch for a new atari title since 1990 what oh yeah it's the only game that's ever been released on the atari 2600 since 1990 haven't well, you heard how about a new atari <laughs> title under the original um well the wording company. Mm, anyway we'll yeah. get to that no i agree i agree mm -hmm. <laughs> pre-order so you can pre-order this um july 31st so it's not ready yet not another month and a half um, Atari XP cartridges are assembled in the U.S. and made from new high quality, blah, blah, blah. Developer John Mikula, publisher Atari Age, platform Atari 2600, mm -hmm. single player. Um, there you go. Pre-order. There's a, there's a little gif there. Um, there's some screenshots, but mm -hmm. there's actually a video. It's not really okay. a video. It's more like another gif because it's not really a video. But anyway, we'll take a look at it. There's no sound to be heard. So there you go. You have a little dog. It's very cute. Um, some play field obstacles. Some some flicker. <laughs> <laughs> um, <laughs> so it is an Atari game. <laughs> it's an Atari game. <laughs> yes. Uh, lots of flicker. Yeah. That's one criticism. And tons of flicker. For no reason there. Absolutely no reason for flicker there. Um, and to show you next level. Um, some enemies, you're jumping over things, you're avoiding things. It's right up my alley for platformers. Okay. I love platformers. Yep, yep, yep. There you go, Mr. Run and Jump. Yeah. Um, cool. Box contents. It, it implies there's a box. It doesn't implicitly say there's a box. Okay. Um, but you get an Atari 2600 cartridge and you get an instruction manual at, at minimum. Um, oh, it says box dimensions. Okay. Mm. I, I think there is a box. They really should say. They've done this before in other releases where okay. it's like ambiguous whether you're getting a box or not. Okay. So if you're getting a box, $60 is not out of the realm of okay. possibility. If okay. you're getting a cartridge... Is that what no. people thought it was? Just the cartridge? If some people were comparing it to the cost of cartridges on Atari Age going, I'd rather buy two games from Atari Age oh, I see. than one game... Yeah. Like they don't give you the option of just buying the just buying the cartridge. cartridge. On if, yeah. yeah. So I'm I am assuming there that, is a that there box. is a box because it does give dimensions that are much bigger yeah. than a cartridge. Um, compatibility, um, Atari twenty six hundred not, not included. included. <laughs> what? Come on. Oh my god. Um, but why is the cart label graphics so different than the actual game? Well, that's that's fine. That's that does matter. Not uncommon. Um, <laughs> One of the uh, bigger problems. <laughs> My joke that, for y'all, yeah. <laughs> that somebody uh, mentioned is look at this cartridge. Yeah. Oh, you can't see it. Um, look well, at this uh, official Loathe Runner cartridge. Gotcha. Oh, let's get the shine off of it. And you notice how I'm holding it mm -hmm. and compare it to the picture on there. Why did Atari all of a sudden change the orientation of their labels? This is the, la is the orientation of Atari cartridges. They're all this way. Well, these are activated cartridges. Oh, I but, see what you're saying. Um, yeah, because when you put it into the system, 
you're looking down on it. Yeah. You're not you're not facing the other side. Like if anything, they should have put it on here to begin with yeah. this this other side. But yeah. anyway. Uh yeah, the label's upside down. Yeah. <laughs> They can change their mind. That's fine. That's yeah. fine. Although it is possible that the one you receive, like this is just a mock-up, and the one you receive, you receive will be like the originals. Do you think? Uh, they have changed their mind before. Oh, yeah. yeah. Carl G says, it's funny to see uh, Atari SA discover the Atari 2600 for the first time. Mm. Yeah. It's like they've been out of the loop. <laughs> and um, unfortunately... The people ran with the press release. I, I don't oh, have yeah. the press release up, but um, I should get the press release up. Let me see. Uh, one second. Let me get the press release up because it's 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 very interesting. Um, do, 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 do. Where is it? Oh, people are still commenting in the Atari Age forums <laughs> about it. Nice. Um, okay, the press release. This it's the wording that everybody's uh, having an issue with, and I'm having an issue with as yeah. well. Um, and there's a little preview of it on the on the Atari page here. Um, so uh, Mockduck posted the press release that Atari put out. Atari is releasing a 2600 version of Mr. Run and Jump, the first new Atari game on a cartridge in 32 years. What? That's news to me. That's news to this whole community, I think. Um, it's, it's, it's all in, in the context of the wording, right? Ooh, yeah. it's rough. Yeah. Arcade platforming action returns to its roots with an exciting announcement unveiling of an Atari 2600 version of the recently revealed action platformer Mr. Run and Jump from Atari. They're making a high-end Atari box a version mm. of this game and it's all fancy and has particle graphics and things like that okay uh the official re release marks a significant milestone steeped in retro history the first cartridge launch for a new atari title since 1990 mm. uh technically yeah <laughs> technically uh um, made by atari dot 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 yes. yeah <laughs> the, the the words new and atari yeah are the real uh, sticking points? They're, they're doing a lot of work, yeah. let's say, in that yeah. sentence. Mm -hmm. um, la, 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 la. Mr. Run and Jump was created in 2021, which I did some digging. It's not. It wasn't actually created in 2021. It was created in 2016. Mm -hmm. I was. I dug way back in the archives today, um, mm -hmm. and I found uh, some video of the developer. Uh, showing it off at a uh, retro gaming convention or a gaming convention. Okay. Um, I don't know if it was finished then. He may finished have finished it in 2021. Okay. But I never heard of it. And I've been meticulously tracking mm. games for the fa past five years for the Atari Awards, et cetera, et cetera. So he didn't, he didn't release it in 2020. Okay. As far as I know, he has never released this Like game. a version of it for people to buy. Not to buy. Yeah. He showed it off. He people showed it People could play it gotcha. at that because he gave us a nice. uh, talk on um, um, programming for the 2600. Mm. Um, but anyway, so they sent out this press release and all the major places that talk about games ran with the wording, let's say. Yeah. And didn't get the subtle creative wording that Atari did. Yeah. And kind of just ignored that. So let's take a look at... What is this? Did I click on something accidentally? You might have. <laughs> Uh, yeah, and Gadget has it, but that is not the... Oh, oh, there, there it is. What the hell? Anyway, <laughs> uh, uh, run, Mr. Run and Jump would be the first official cartridge for the Atari 2600. That That is also very suspect. Yeah. That's a problematic sentence as well. Yeah. Because they're saying Atari is the only company... Who makes official who cartridges. Makes official cartridges. Which I have... There's a history here. <laughs> a game yeah. called Pitfall here. Yeah. Which is apparently not an official cartridge for the Atari 2600. <laughs> and in yeah. fact, Atari sued this company. Yeah. To prevent them from putting out this cartridge. Yeah. They lost. Yeah. Well, they didn't lose. Nobody lost. They settled out of court. Yeah. But anyway, <laughs> that's... that. I guess Atari or Engadget is sticking to the fact that this is not an official mm -hmm. Atari game. I think about a million or so people would uh, argue that. Mm -hmm. um, but then they double down on in the article here. 
Um, uh, da, 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 da. Oh, oh, oh. oh, even they, they even mentioned Pitfall. That's terrible. Um, oh, no, I don't think this is the one that did injustice. Anyway, here's another one from IGN. <laughs> uh, the title's pretty good. The Mr. Run and Jump will be Atari's first 2600 cartridge okay. in over 30 years. First new 2600 mm -hmm. cartridge. Um, start digging your Atari console out of the attic. Nice. Mm. If you have it. <laughs> um, here, here's the problem. Uh, Mr. Run and Jump may be, may be coming out on consoles and PC later this year, but the action platformer will also come packaged in Atari 2600 cartridge, marking it the first new 2600 cartridge game in over 30 years. I have a shelf full of not new, <laughs> not 2600 yeah. games. They didn't even add Atari in that sentence. Yep. So, I don't know. I don't know. I just, it ticked me off. Yeah. And it ticked a bunch of people it's, in the forums off. Yeah. Discrediting. Yeah. Everything this community has built since the mid 90s when the first homebrew came out. They're just ignoring all of it. Yeah. And, and saying, no, that none of that counts. It's not official. Yeah. It's not real because Atari didn't put it out. Yeah. No. Um, ignoring all the third-party content that came out during the 80s and 90s as well. Well, I like how well-written <sighs> the press release is because, as I say, it's the context. Yeah. But they know that it's going to be repurposed in other articles yeah. and misinterpreted. So it's sort of like, well, it's not their fault it was misinterpreted. No, it's not. But it, it, it's, 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 it's a... Their wording was on the edge and everybody else just yeah. didn't get that context. Or they'd have to copy it word for word to make sure it it's was It's a deliberate it manipulation, in a way, to, uh, to make sure that they get that a lot far. of it. No, but to get attention, right? Yeah. yeah. But anyway. and, and that's another yeah. problem as well. They yeah. got so much press today yeah. from this release. Wow. And how much press do unbelievable yeah. games that are put out every year um, and I counted 25 cartridge released games in 2022. Oh, yeah. Because I keep, I, I'm the one who keeps track of them all. Um, and how many of them got press in, in Gadget and IGN? No, yeah. I'd say yeah. I would, I haven't done research, but probably zero. Yeah, yeah. And they are absolutely stunning, stunning games. I'm not taking anything away from this game. No, no, it's not, it's, you're not, you're not, not talking about the game or the quality of this game. Shitting on this game or anything no. like that. That's not the, the purpose, right? Yeah. 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 And um, I actually reached out to the developer today to try and get the game on the show because yeah. I want to play it. It's yeah. a new 2600 game. Yeah. Um, I, he probably will just maybe ignore it because he's yeah. probably flooded with other people that have a much higher profile than this show. Um, but who knows? Yeah. When is Conan O'Brien coming over? Yeah. I watched that. I had to turn those off. Conan O'Brien playing 2600 games. He had just... I mean, the title is Clueless Gamer. Oh, oh boy, he did he is. actually play some 2600 he games did. on he it? He did. He was baffled. Oh, really? <laughs> Which, you know, he did play E.T., I think, once. And some yeah. of the other ones, he, he wasn't given any instruction. Gotcha. Which, you know, whatever, I haven't seen... I, have, I don't think I've really watched too it many was, of those. It was hard so. to watch. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it was hard. Yeah. And he's in the right demographic, but, I, you know, some people don't play games. No. Um, anyway, that, I think that's enough of a rant. Um, <laughs> it's just... It just makes me upset that... Yeah what we do here as a community it gets ignored and a game is put out touted as the first game for yeah. atari in yeah. since 1990 well, but that's why you do the show so well, so exactly you can right. give some exposure to those games that don't have big marketing companies behind them right so rage <laughs> yeah rage um and that exactly that was my next point is that those... this is why i do the show because these games were not getting yeah. the exposure they deserve. They're getting a bit more in, in the years that have followed since I started the show because yeah. more streams and not streams, but more YouTube channels, mm -hmm. some streams, uh, have are playing more homebrews. Mm -hmm. None dedicated solely to homebrews, but they're throwing in homebrews, 2,600 homebrews here and there, and that's great. 
Um, so yeah. I'm happy about that. But that's why I started the show. Yeah. Because they were not getting the exposure. Well, and those websites like Engadget and IGN, I mean, they serve as marketing platforms. They get sent yeah. games by people to market the games, to do articles on them. Yeah. They're not choosing... They're not going out in the world and finding gems to write articles on. No, they get sent. Stuff. They get they're they're there to market for these companies, right? Yeah. So that's why you need to watch Zero Page Homebrew. Rod Kessler says I kind of yeah. feel that way too. Unfair to the incredible homebrew stuff being yes. released. Yeah. It just doesn't get the press cuz all of a sudden Atari drops this thing and goes, "Yep. Huge press." Yeah. Magical huge press. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Your show is the number one resource. <laughs> well, you thank go. you very much. <laughs> I like to think so. But, you know. Yeah, they just shovel the press releases out. Yeah, yeah, it's very true. So we'll see if he gets back to me and I'm able to play the game on the show. That'd be cool. Yeah. Before it's released to the public. and You get to play the first Atari cartridge <laughs> released in 30 years. Yeah, I've been doing this show for five years. <laughs> And finally, I get to play Atari 2600 Homebrew, yeah. uh, not Homebrew, yeah. first Atari cartridge, no yeah. Homebrew mentioned in That's there. That's very true. Is you, it Homebrew? Uh-oh, now we have another uh, well, spicy topic I, to I discuss. Believe, I believe the um, <laughs> the author, I'll have to look officially, he called it Homebrew before yeah. Atari scooped it up. Fair enough. Um, yeah, Atari said, we saw it in 2021 and thought it was awesome, and so we're going to put it on our platform. It's like, okay, weird. <laughs> um, anyway. Enough ranting. I'm sure there's enough ranting in the in the in the um, in the forums for everyone else to, to yeah back with tea. Yeah. Hey, uh, Renard goes. Hey, Renard goes. Yeah, lots of tea going down, spilling it all over the place, along with Tanya's drink. Uh, yeah. Double Down posted this today. Uh, he was talking about this on the show in the chat. Oh, really? Um, oh, yeah, I do remember. And yeah. he's like, "I'm making bubble bubble controllers," and he did did it so quick so they look absolutely amazing i not how cute is that sure if they are only two-way joysticks but they might be two-way joysticks only left and right movement he'll have to uh, confirm that I'm well if you sure want if to use your bubble bo bubble controller for other games you might want it to be four-way four -way, yeah, yeah. <laughs> So, so it, it really is a standard 7800 mm. joystick as far as I can. I don't know what that switch is, though. That's, he doesn't mention what that sit, switch is. Oh, Double Down is here. It is yep. set up for two-way. <gasps> wow, it is Ooh, purpose. And he also mentioned like uh, somewhere about in another thread about this being uh, also works for uh, Lunar Patrol, mm. uh, another of old styles game, because that's also a two-way game, oh. left and right. It would also work for Popeye. As yes, well. it would. It would, yeah. Because Popeye is a two way game, too. Do you, no, no, no. You go you up duck? and down the stairs. Do you duck? You go up and down the you stairs. You do go up and down the stairs. I'm just thinking, oh, it doesn't have jump. But no, no, no. Um, so it'll be good. But you get Bob Edition and Bob Edition. So you get what? both go. of them. <gasps> They're green and blue? Yeah, oh, that's so Bob cute. and Bob. It's super, super <laughs> that's cute. Awesome. The Way toggle to switches the joystick up and down for menu navigation. Oh my god. So you technically could use this to play games very awkwardly. Four way games. <laughs> wow. But yeah, oh wow, that is super cool. That is awesome. Also, also useful for Mario that's Bros. Perfect. Yeah. So it'll work for all three of wow. old styles games? That's funny. Wow! That all three of his games are two-way games. He's just an expert in the two-way games. Yeah, you yeah. just it's too hard to program uh, up and down. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's so funny. Oh, that's oh, cool. amazing. So it gives a lot of detail nice. uh, about the joysticks in here. And he uh, posted a picture of other... Um, what is that? That looks like a console, a joystick built into a console. It does. A ColecoVision It's got a console. handle on the side, too. Can I zoom in on that? What is that? Yeah, it says ColecoVision. Wow. And it's got... No, uh, I think it just looks like a ColecoVision. That's that's really, really cool. Wow. O'Brien's It Is Mario, like in Mars. Mario? Mario. Mario? I've Mario? Heard it. I've, Mario? I, Mario? I've seen videos, and they've found official Nintendo videos that pronounce it both ways. So. Oh, really? Any, official ones? Everyone's free to pronounce it any way they there want. There you go. It's a me, Mario. <laughs> Mario. Yeah, so that's that's in uh, the games. 
So, but yeah. Hey, is it Tanya or Tanya? That's a con. That's a to me. It's uh, yeah. Tanya. Yeah. <laughs> and to her parents, it's Tanya. Yeah. Yeah. Um. Okay. James, on tonight's Jaguar games, will they be sold through Atari H store or by the developers? That is a very good question. None of them are really close to being ready to be sold, so we'll have to wait a bit for that. But um, we'll be getting into that because Jalaga mm -hmm. is just started. It's mm. only a three level demo. Okay. Um, and uh, Burger Time is complete. Okay. But we will get into releases later about that two ways the right way and the wrong way yeah. <laughs> right gif jif yes exactly gif jif lava uh -huh. lava uh -huh. what La lava 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 okay let's get to the first game and uh <laughs> when i heard this was being announced i was very excited jalaga <laughs> um by eric desert desert how would you pronounce that in French? Desert. Desert. I don't know. <laughs> um, Eric D4, DE45 for the code, yep. and Mick for design and graphics, and uh, Matthew Stempel for the music. <laughs> the creator said otherwise, but he was wrong. Yeah, it's it's GIF. It's GIF. It's GIF. As in giraffe. It's GIF. Yes, yeah, graphics, graphics, interchange format, yeah. interchange format, but the creator said... GIF. GIF. But again... And he created it. Doesn't so matter. would you tell somebody their name is pronounced wrong? Your name's pronounced wrong. No, but it's that's you pronounce your that's name a wrong, proper by name. the way. That's not that's not a noun. So it's now not an acronym. In, the language it changes and yeah. how people and he pronounce things. <laughs> yeah. But but it doesn't matter who creates it, it's language. But the person has a proper There's name. There's so many so. arguments about that, especially yep. scuba. Try and pronounce scuba, scuba using the let the pronunciation oh, of the letters. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Self contained underwater breathing apparatus. And you take the way you pronounce them in the words, and it sounds crazy if you yeah. pronounce it together. I can't do it because yeah. I'm going to do the show. <laughs> <laughs> so let's uh, get on with uh, yeah. playing the games. Jalaga first. It does sound Ooh. like a mis uh, mispronunciation of Galaga. Yeah. And I think that's the, uh, that's the intent, which is fairly funny. Pronounce composite. Oh, yes. It depends if you're British or not, too. A lot of these words. Mm -hmm. uh, don't say aluminium because that's spelled differently. Mm. Um, mm. Oh, you're not playing with that. I'm not? That's not a Jaguar control. Oh. <laughs> that's there a Jaguar go. control. There it is. Okay. Oh, actually, before, uh, before we do this, uh, do we have any videos for this one? No. Okay. We can do this. Okay. Let's do it. Um, Jalaga. So this is uh, a three-level demo um, from uh, May 28th, so not too long ago. It's just I was away and then booked up with other things. I wanted to play this immediately as soon as I got it. Just didn't didn't work out. The developer <laughs> gave it things. to me like one day ahead of the uh... public release. Awesome Ooh, music nice. in the title screen. So Jalaga by Dune, demo version. Uh, we basically make up the rules. Don't press it yet. Did I say press it? No. You, the way you paused, I thought you wanted me to press it. No. Oh, my oh, well. goodness. That's okay. Everyone can listen on their own time. Turn it up. Yeah, right into the first bullet. Perfect. What? Oh, I didn't even see that. Jeez. <laughs> oh, yeah, they do look a little... Ah, ha, ha. There we go. Volumes, right? Yep. Get in there. So, um, in the forums, um, it was posted uh, Jalaga, an Atari Jaguar game by Dune. Uh, Gem Toes 2023 demo version, design and graphics by Mick, M musics by Matthew Stempel, and code by Eric Desert. Uh, demo released at the Gem Toes 2023, an Atari convention held in Saint Just et Chaussée, France, uh, 27th and 28th of May 2023. The full game will feature 25 levels, five different worlds, wow. and hopefully a cartridge release. So hopefully a cartridge release. <laughs> I, 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 I ah. think this will get a cartridge release. I think demand oh, will be so, good. so high for this because it looks absolutely gorgeous. Um, it does play quite 
different it, than it's Galaga. Quite a bit different, yeah. Um, first in the fact that your bullets are quite a bit slower. And I think their bullets are quite a bit slower too. And the power up you got, did you did you yes, get your ship? I yeah. did. It's quite easy to get because you just shoot the ship. You don't have to accidentally you don't accidentally kill your ship. Um, like with normal Galaga. <laughs> 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 Oh my goodness. And uh, when you shoot them, they explode into little... They do. Little bits of fading... I, I don't know. I find the uh, shots a little, like, distracting. Or, or uh, hard to see. Ah! Their shots? No. Uh, you no, know, the colorful one. I'm expecting them to be white somehow and because there's such oh. a background. Every um, Tower Collections in mo uh, says, In motion, I think I would get confused between, between the enemy fire and the orange stars in the background. Um, I mean, the enemy fire is elongated. Um, it's their explosions that look like the stars. So it kind of blends in. Mm -hmm. and, uh, I think that's the end of the game, unfortunately. Is it? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it looks so. fantastic. I love the scrolling background, I, too. And it, it, uh, oh, there we go. There you go. So I get to play now. You're changing those stars because of feedback. This year, no. Are they? Oh, okay. Uh, Agree about the background oh, star colors? Yeah, their shots are colorful, and I think a white, a solid white would help. Yeah. Or maybe not white, because you your shots I, are I white. kind of, I, I mean, it's I not like that them. I don't like the colorful, but they do get lost a little bit in the stars. I think that's why I ran immediately into one, because I, oh. I, I thought it was background for a second, but, I mean, you do get used to it, so yeah. it's not It's not that you can't see it. but. And um, the, uh, the graphics of everything. Oh, amazing. it looks fantastic. The the parallax scrolling yeah. of the multi-level ship that love, you're flying I love, through. Yeah, it looks really good. It does look like you're either flying over a ship or you're in a ship. Mm -hmm. Have to add this to the JAG game drive. Yes, so this is available on the Atari Age forums. Um, just, oh my god, I ran into one too! Yeah, yeah, oh, it, you're so absolutely it is, right. you do have to pay, yeah. pay close attention to the to the shots. Okay. Yeah. Or maybe I was looking at Anyway, I ran yeah. into one. Well, yeah, I can just see oh later on if that it gets really fault. hectic with lots of enemy fire that you start dodging the stars, getting confused with <laughs> the heat of action. Dodging the stars. Or run into enemy fire because you confuse them for the background, yeah. And that's why, like, um, developers releasing demos or, or letting me show it off on the show yeah. so that we can give feedback yeah. before the final final release of the yeah. game. Um, because there's there's things like this where it's like they're subtle and maybe the developers don't notice because they're either really good at the game already well also they... you know you do get used to it too i you think do. it's just just initially. initially i think i was like oh that's not background <laughs> and the patterns yeah. are great oh yeah. the flying patterns the spinning yeah oh, i really so like good. it yeah and you know we have galaga on so many platforms why not job. why oh we only have one life left Okay. Yeah. Let's see how that works out. Um, why not make it a little different? Yeah. It's it's closer to um, like Galaga 88 almost um, in that respect of the looks. And um, It doesn't have to come down. You can just shoot it. Maybe it'll never come down. Maybe I'll stay on level 3 forever. <laughs> and never die. I don't think it's going to come down. Bug. Oh. Oh my god. Yeah. It does eventually. Tricked me. I wonder if I'll get my... Yay, don't shoot it. Nope. Well, that's the end, I think. I think I made all three. Yeah, call it part. This is part of the challenge. Yeah. Um, the entrance formations remind me of, Gal of Galaga arrangement a bit. Mm. Yeah, Cubanismo. I let him know about the star issue. He said the background art is go going to change, so it'll it'll be addressed, so it'll look a little different. That's good. That's yeah. good. I don't, I don't think it's that... That, but it's yeah. it's not you terrible, get used to it when you're paying attention you're like oh yeah yeah i can oh yeah um yeah and it's interesting like when you get the pat when you get the the ship your second ship um you don't seem to get any hot like your shots aren't faster let's do this your shots aren't faster they do change color but i even yeah they, they don't give you seem to give you any kind of power up at all. When oh you get God. the second ship? Yeah. No, you I'm... get a big blobby bullet, don't you? Your bullet shape changes. 
it changes, but it doesn't go fast. No, it doesn't, no, it do doesn't go faster. It just like gets in the original bigger. Galaga, you get two it, shots, right? Because it doesn't become a big white bullet, or am I can maybe I. So that. right now it's kind of bluish white. Yeah. Um, so let's get the power up. I mean, as you say, it is an early demo, so it I'm is. sure there's a lot that's going to get added in. Yeah. So there let's do that. I love, I love the art though. The oh, art looks gorgeous. fantastic. The colors are vivid. And 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 the um, enemy ships, they look really good. Oh yeah. The music, background music is really good. Yes. Like everything. Yeah. Miss demo is is top notch. And it killed two enemies with one shot. Well, I will get my oh. ship as soon as it's plugged in. Hi. And then we'll see. Oh, wow. Ooh, it's got it. Um, this is, go. this is only one backdrop. There are multiple backdrops. Very nice. Yeah, it I, says I'm, there's going to be five levels. Nice. Five stages. Worlds. Five worlds. Come on. Give me the ship. There we go. Okay. So now the ship gets bigger. Ship gets You're bigger. It looks ship. different. And maybe, when you shoot... Maybe it can take two hits. Now See, it's bigger. Look how much bigger that so is. So it's wider. Okay. It is wider. But it's still only... Ah, and now you're dead. Oh, you're back to your did original lose... ship. You lost your yellow ship. Yeah. But did I lose a life? No. I don't think so. Okay, so no. that's... Okay, but it's that, wider. I would assume get a second life. that mechanism might change. Like... Yeah, because... You're losing Usually you lose a life completely. Because you lose a life anyway. So. Here you're losing... Yeah, you are kind of losing. So really the only benefit is that you get a slightly wider shot. And I'm not sure you've lost a ship at the top, are you? When, you're, when your new ship comes oh, out right now? Oh, no, you, you did do. lose. Yep, yeah, you goes. do. Okay. okay, so you do lose it. Yeah. But like, a, like you said, it's an early demo, so... Oh, it's so cool. I like the, the pulsating butterfly it becomes. It's yeah, like, I've really got your ship. Ha, ha, ha. Come on. What if I shoot it now? Do I get my ship yeah, back? Yeah, you do. You do? Yeah. Really? That's not how I got one. Oh, because in the original, you have to be careful. Not to shoot not it. Not to shoot it because tumbling. it becomes an enemy. But that's what I mean. It. It's possible this is still a it's demo, change, so that, yeah. that could change. Yeah. I mean, the developers around, they probably know what, what their intent is with that. Oh, so. I love this this spinny release of ships though. It's and they come so out of nowhere. Chaotic. They come out of like a oh, black oh. hole. Yeah. To I love the middle it. of the screen. It's really nice. <laughs> yeah. So they've really made Galaga their own with this. We're taking like the basics of it and really changing it up. Come on. Last guy. There we go. Demo's over. Can it kill two enemies? No. Mm. I mean, oh, you mean if we shoot in between, that might be difficult to show. Mm. Yeah. So really great. It looks fantastic. Looks fantastic. Yeah. Sounds fantastic. Um, great demo. <laughs> um, so we're going to move on to La Baie de Mer. Um But I think I have something to show because this game mm. um, is a port of another game of the same name, of course. So let's take a look at that. La Baie de Mort. I'll change the graphic of the cartridge as Ooh. well. The page. So it was originally a PC game in 2010. Okay. Even though it looks like this. Um, but we'll look at a video in a second. Um, so Faith will be your only weapon in this platformer styled like a ZX Spectrum game. Black mm -hmm. backgrounds, one color sprites, uh, and one bit sounds are a proper fit for a raw story. The lack of details turn on the player's imagination, uh, creating a unique experience for each player. Plot in the 13th century, the Cathars, clerics who preached about the poverty of Christ and defended life without material aspirations, were treated as heretics by the Catholic Church and expelled them out of the Languedoc, 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 Languedoc region. Uh, I don't know. Uh, region in France. One of them, called Jean Raymond, uh, found an old church in which to hide from crusaders, not knowing that beneath its ruins lay buried in ancient evils. Not only does he have to hide from crusaders, he has to hide from the evils in this church as well. Mm. Um, 
Look and feel of ZX Spectrum game. 23 screen, screens to explore, riddles and hints to find items. Nice. Around 30 minutes of game length once fully, fully mastered. Fully mastered, yeah. So you can see what it looks Ooh, like nice. there. Very, Very nice. nicely detailed. Yeah. ZX Spectrum had really well detailed games but the colors were kind of very blocky. solid and blocky yes, so yeah. it was like this trade-off yeah um la bay d'amour was has been inspired by the tragic history of the cathars and play platform games from the zx spectrum mm -hmm. computers like M manic minor jet set willie or dynamite dan a lot of games were like this um in europe in the 80s um especially for like the uh, micro PCs, 8-bit micro PCs in, in um, Europe and mm. Britain. Um, and it said they were, it was created at nights during a trip to the south of France. And uh, you can download it for free there on, on their website. So let's take a quick look at... Oh my god, that's loud. One second. Let me turn it down and also make it full screen. There we go. So this is the PC version, just so we can compare it to what we're going to see for the Jaguar. Abbey of the Dead. Yes. The one we're going to play doesn't have this uh, little Opener? intro. Okay. Yeah, the intro and... Um, that was kind of explained. It doesn't have this screen. It starts you in... In the... Uh, in the... Dungeon or the... Uh, no, the church. Abbey. The, the Abbey. Abbey. Yeah. yeah. So it starts not there, but the next screen. Yeah. Abandoned church. The altar. This yeah. screen, I think, it starts in this one. Mm -hmm. So you can see it's um, mono chrome sprites <laughs> of different colors, mm -hmm. but it looks really nice, really detailed. Let's skip ahead a bit. Nice you platformer. Have a sh no shot or anything. You just you have, jump and avoid. As yeah, it looks like you're a pacifist priest, I guess. Well, yeah. Hey, yeah. that that yeah. works. <laughs> that jives. That, yep. Yeah. Some gorgeous, on, gorgeous on brand, graphics and animation. Yeah. yeah. Really, really nice. Not the cathars, but. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Secrets. Oh. oh boy. That one's fairly obvious. Not too bad. Yeah. Nice. Yeah. yeah very oh. nice. Oh monsters. my god. Oh my goodness. Okay. So let's get into the Jaguar <laughs> game oh, before we spoil dark. too much for ourselves. Nice. Let me just adjust this. Flip back over. Okay. There you go. Ready? La Bay de Mort. Yes. So this We're is here. made by Party Time oh, for Kittens. Cats, it's party cats, time for kittens. Cats, cats, cats. Cats, cats, cats. cats, cats, cats. Press button. Press button. Press you want button. me to? Yes. And um, we'll just... Th that... Actually, we'll do the party time for kittens first. Okay. We'll party in. time for kittens. <laughs> party time for kittens. Who triggered Woo! that? Who, who said party time? Nostalgic. Thank nostalgic. you. Nostalgic. Hey, cats, thank you. Now, tiny, tiny bit. He just rolls around in it. He doesn't I need know. it. I know. There's not much left. Do we have some? Some more? Some more? Uh, I think we might, might need to order some, actually. Okay. That's here. good. That's good. Here, here, here. There's some here. Let's figure out what, who wants what there. Mm -hmm. Oh, Sprite. Oh, there he goes. Sprite's going <laughs> to do it now. he got a taste He's like, for oh, it. wait. What is that? <laughs> oh, give me the catnip. Getting the cats high before the treat tournament. Oh, I see. Yeah, that's a smart move. Yeah, nostalgic. Getting them all hungry, getting them revved up. <laughs> or completely calm down, one or the other. Yeah, they do pass out afterwards. They do. They roll around, they go, uh. Mainly this little black kitten. Oh, he's what so funny. What are you doing? He flipped it over. Yeah. Oh, kitten. There you go. He flipped it over and started scratching at it. Oh, You're he's so excited. Silly. He does love it. Now he's scratching. Oh, he's oh it's all over the so floor now. Catnip everywhere. Of course. Well, it's time to vacuum anyway. <laughs> <laughs> it's always time to vacuum with this black cat. We have to vacuum after every episode, pretty much. Oh, <laughs> catnip everywhere. Okay. We're sitting on catnip here. <laughs> <laughs> he, he doesn't care. He's he crazy. does not care. Okay, let's load it up again. All right. Now, it shows a title screen for a split second. And oh, then does flips it? Over. Uh... So watch really carefully. Oh, actually, 
Maybe I'm don't press anything. anything because maybe it'll sit on the screen oh. like it buffers the, the button Possibly. or something. Maybe. Nope. <laughs> no, just title screen for a millisecond. So uh, in this demo, okay. uh, this work in progress, not a demo, um, you can't die. Okay. So because I've already been hit. Oh, you by... can die, but you just can't die from the creatures. So if you fall oh. into a spiky pit or fall into water, an invisible path over a wood bridge. Okay. If you fall into water or into a spike, that, that you can die, but you can collect all the items though. So like these flowers. Nothing hurts you. No creatures hurt you. Okay. Like that spider doesn't so hurt you. So it is you. very much a work in progress. Oh, yeah, 100%. Oh. Um, so this was um, put out in August 2021, and it was uh, part of the Silly Venture Summer Edition 2021 competition, and it placed first because it looks absolutely gorgeous. So you want to get that heart, but you don't want to fall in that water down oh, that there. So you got to be careful. A door. Yep. Oh, the water will kill me. And this is actually ported over from a Dreamcast version made by the same uh, development team of Osio, um, which is uh, Mars. Per people who worked on this, uh, Pris Priscilla mm -hmm. Panda, uh, Marshall, Marshall Devaud, uh, Mars for graphics, who's oh. astounding at graphics. So I think you're going to have to go up top and around to get that cross up there. Ugh. Just gonna have to jump across oh. that pit if you can. Ugh. I don't know if that... Nope. No, don't fall. Oh! On. on fire. Wow, I don't know how to get over there. Uh, I think that skull... Well, you have to jump instead of falling. So I think you could jump on that skull. Nope, I don't think so. Oh, it looks like you passed through it, maybe. Oh. <sighs> the backgrounds are really nice. Yeah, some hot water. Try again. That's Warmy. okay. It might be uh, the... That's a platform. Hit yeah, your head. yeah. <laughs> An invisible path over a wood bridge. Hmm. Hints, hints. So um, this was really posted without much to say about it, probably because it is a port of another game. So I would go back up, because unless you want to go through that door. Well, I oh. want to go up here. There, there you go. So I do have to jump across, basically. Yep. But that spider doesn't hurt you. But you can pretend it does and try and avoid it. As far as I can tell, all mm -hmm. this game needs, if it has all the screens, is collision between the enemies and you. Because everything else seems to work. There's mm -hmm. the dragon. Oh, the dragon's asleep. Mm -hmm. There's like a, a guy there. A crusader. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's some. An upside down cross that doesn't seem like it would be oh god that was a large fall yeah <laughs> is that good uh, or bad i guess you can't collect it in the full game I, oh nice. it does turn when you pass it oh, so i don't it opens know if... or closes something mm. i would only hit it once yeah the thing in the last room turned Really? Did we miss one? Yeah. No, oh. no. Every time you pass in front of it, it turns. So you maybe want to open all of them? Well, I maybe... don't know if I've opened them. They just turn. I, yeah. I, I I, think maybe you have to hit them all. And it needs sound, too. There's no yeah. sound. So can I go up that way? I don't think so. Well, nothing I hurts you, so you can just go through. So. Well. Oh, lots uh, of pits. You definitely can go on those skulls. You think so? Because there's no other way you can get past that. Oh, yeah. you can, yep. Yeah. You are correct. I'm guessing those fish... Might move? Jump up. Yeah. Would jump up. So there, there is a bit to do. Jump to death and prove your faith. Oh, boy. Blind jump. Interesting. So I'm guessing... <gasps> oh, oh, no. No, I bet you have to jump across. Oh, and there's a hidden platform yeah, or something? Yeah, probably. Yeah, so... Oh... Like something hidden, like a fake platform there, but I probably yeah. fell rather than jump. Because so. you walked on that platform. And yeah, it doesn't, well, doesn't look like it um, is fully there. Oh, nice ghosty. Ooh, scary. Like Indiana Jones and the Last Crusade. Yes, that's right. 
see, turned. Ah, I bet you have to turn all of them in the game to, to open something or build a bridge or... Hmm. Oh, yes. Okay, so this was uh, put on the PC originally in 2010. Uh, then it was a bunch of ports came out. Uh, I have the approximate dates. No, no, you did that last time. No, but I jump. no, but I fell. I fell through it. I was on it. Yeah, you get you're what on I mean. It. I was on it, and then I was here, and I no, I didn't. I oh, fell really? through it. Yeah. So I think it it um. Have to get on and jump immediately then. Well, I'll show you. Like, I I I was like right on the edge of it. Like I don't yeah I don't oh, think I don't. I, I'll sh yeah, here, I'll go back. Oh, I see. Uh, That's a save point. That's what it is. There. See? Oh, uh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, I don't Not know. Not sure. Anyway. Uh, then, it came, then it actually came out on the ZX Spectrum. Ah. In 2014, four years later. Came out the Sega Genesis slash Mega Drive. 2017, C64 in 2019, Dreamcast 2019, Amiga 2020, mm. NES 2021, Atari Falcon... 2022 super rare system um so it did come out in the atari already mm. i think that's all the notes i have for this mm. it's cool so you Thank continue you. to oh they're all save points oh i didn't quite they're understand just save what you're points. saying they're, oh, okay oh, didn't need to do that. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. so there's must be s oh you're trying to get to that um next platform there okay. well i wanted to see if what this is Oh, it is something new. Yeah, very nice yeah. animations on those skeletons. 12 brothers hid and died here. Ooh. Oh, what? Red. I oh, you went there. up through a floor. <laughs> you I, can't get back down now. I can't get back down. Weird. Probably another way to get back down. Save point. Neat. Oh. Jump. Jump. Jumping uh, at the wrong time. But I wanted to show this game, even though it was, it's kind In of... early stages? Yeah. Well, it's kind of been That's abandoned, unfortunately. Has Ooh. it? Oh, wonderful. That's the door. They're trying to get in. Got to get up there. Maybe there's a timer in the original game. Because I want to see this finished. And it seems so close, right? Yeah. I mean, it does need music, which is a big, big thing. But there's already, like, music. It just needs the music ported over to the Jaguar system. Um, and... Looks like some collision, a little bit of collision, a little bit of animation, like fish here and there. Um, really liking the stained glass. Everything, the colors. Oh, hit the bell. Oh. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, nice. I bet that door opens at some point. That looks really nice. Did it? Did the it? bell like ding or move? Yeah, it oh, went from it. bright yellow to uh, oh, so it. Uh, so it's like a little mission you have to do. Yeah. I'm sure there's a point to it. Watch out for those rats. Oh, they look mean. Mean ratties. Mm. Oh, that's a lot of Another scroll spiders. and another cross. So you see in the bottom right there, and I've got oh. the instructions from the original, um, 12 crosses against the devil. There you go. So that's what it has in the instructions here. Collect 12 crosses. That makes Cathar sense. Cathar crosses. If you touch any creature or moving item, one life is taken away. Okay. Not in this version. Um, if Not you lose yet. all your lives, the game is over. So you have two mm -hmm. lives left now. Read the message. Read the messages for hints. Yeah, the stained glass is beautiful. Some broken chairs down there. And activate mechanisms to open doors. And it oh, shows a switch. I can get back down now. Oh, you did something. Maybe the bell. I don't know. Maybe it, or yeah, I don't know. Let's see if we can find all the twelve crosses. Oh yeah, yep. And just don't fall into pits. That's all you have to not do. <laughs> yeah. You got three now. Mm-hmm. Oh, and there are hearts. Are those lives? I'm guessing they give you lives or or maybe because you get five and you get lives back. A bit of slowdown. There is a bit of slowdown in a few spots. Four brothers change their fate. Mm -hmm. But it's weird. It's only when you're moving, right? If you stop moving. Yeah. So a little bit of optimization needs to happen. Looks good. Oh, gorgeous. And yet another platformer. Love it. Mm -hmm. Every screen has a unique title. Yes, yes. Great Druins. And that's, that's a hallmark of those early 8-bit European games. Um, yeah, now you have three lives. Nice. 
is that every screen had its own um, title on it. Oh, another life. Oh, I've that been guy here before. Yeah. Menacing. He looks like he's he's he not just moving now. Straight goes straight for you. I think you are absolutely correct. Don't fall into the pit. No! Oh my god. Oh, I didn't die. Interesting. Oh, oh, what? I didn't die. No, you didn't. Interesting. I went through. Hey, mm. You can't collect that. Hmm. I wonder what that's for. Oh, get that heart, because you'll. Right, you have to go there. That's how you do it. I've I've gotten this before. Oh, really? Yeah. That heart? Yeah. In another game, though. Ooh, Ooh there's nice. a switch. How would you get that switch? Do you have to hop on that guy's back? No, Ooh. there's no way. What was the leap of faith? I'm not sure. We didn't find. No, no we didn't do it. I I. Uh... Oh, it's oh a my door. god. Oh, maybe go from that side. Like the no, it was another. Video. It was another level. Is this guy real? He yeah. will shoot arrows in the real game. Oh, look at the upside down crosses. Nice. Oh yeah, look at that. Another save point. So nice. I mean, obviously they don't. Not everything has its. Glide through the beast cage. Oh. No, it's not this one. Jump up and go. No. Nope, no. No, there is no beast on that that side. There is another room with a beast. Oh, okay. I think it's it's giving you hints to For other, other rooms. rooms. Yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, oh my God! On the ceiling. Don't fall in those pits. Don't hit those spikes. They seem to be the only thing that can kill you. Yeah, those aren't active. No, they're not. Whatever they are. I don't think you can climb up. No. No. They're just decorative. And also the rocks have have graphics like they're curved. They're really mm. nice. Um, oh, can I can't you duck? duck, no. Try other buttons. Oh, there we go. That would explain Jaguar it. Jaguar has three buttons. We're not I used know. to that. <laughs> well, you can crawl too. Mm -hmm. ah! And dead. And, and dead. dead. <laughs> mm. Right now they don't kill me. Nice jump. Ah. Oh, you can get up there pretty quick again. Mm -hmm. I hope so. Pretty cute character. Very cute. Great um, colors on him. All the browns. Mm -hmm. Nice. Okay, my turn. Okay. That was the leap of faith. What was the leap of faith? I I'm don't not know. sure yet. <laughs> Oh, what? All the crosses. Yeah. What? Weird. Isn't this on the ColecoVision as well? The VG Double Oh, has. yes. Oh, there. I got one cross. Well, oh, that's my how God. you get all your crosses. Oh, oh, you're not getting them now. It was a fake cross. Something weird is happening oh. there. Can you jump on this? Satan. Those? Oh, is this a boss? Satan. Oh, a boss I bet it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I can't get the rest of them. <laughs> 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 this is definitely a boss room. Hmm. Can you jump down? Ooh, should I? Yep, I think you should. I don't think so. No. no. Oh. Wasting my life. Wasting my life. Got four lives, so. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> I was lucky. Yeah. Doing pretty good. So now we know where Satan is. Yep. It's oh, it's yeah, it's unfortunately a little cross. too easy because you don't die when you hit the. Uh, this is gonna be hard the bad when dudes. it's uh when it's actually done yeah for sure. oh yeah yeah i bet it's unforgiving like yeah. that guy shooting arrows like you have to jump over these guys probably and avoid the and arrows, avoid the arrows the i'm guessing yeah and jump over him and so somehow you have to get up get there that switch i don't know hmm. maybe you need you're missing something in another room yeah that'll create a platform or he shoots something at you and i don't know yeah that builds something yeah. oh where haven't we gone? Know. Or maybe you can fall through the ground. I've not know. gone up. I haven't gone up to the. I've gone up that way, but um, oh, you can try it again. Have I been to the right? I can't oh remember. My God. Sorry. Or fall through the ceiling yet? The oh, there's a door. We haven't been through uh, there. Uh, we haven't flicked no, that I switch. Did either. I start there? I started there. Yeah. Oh, okay, okay. So go down and see if you can get over 
pa- yeah, you can. Oh, oh no, you have to definitely jump. The, definitely. The, the timing of the jumping and walking, oh, kitties, is not easy. Oh. Okay, flip. There we go. What did that do? Okay, it's a one-way switch. Yeah. Now, if you go through... <gasps> oh, my God. You got eaten. So, let's not no, do that. No, other side. Other oh. side. Oh. <sighs> Poor kitty. He's having an asthma attack. Yeah. Oh, I got past him. Poor cat. Oh. oh, oh um, so, obviously, that dragon has temporary graphics or something. Yeah, but you have to sneak pro- from oh, the I, left. I bet he breathes down. He might, yeah. So I think you go up there and sneak, yes. right? Yes, That's yes, what we yes. figured. Oh, kitty. And I get an extra heart. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh, we what started over again. Or something, I don't know. Oh, oh. It's so. Oh my god, it's so hard. It is finicky. The jumping is finicky. Because if you're if you move and jump, there's a small window. You have to kind of jump first almost, then move. Yeah. Yes, you do. Yeah. Not and move then jump, yeah. which is how you normally do it. Yeah, there's a lot of games that are kind of like that. But. Yeah. Oh. Oh. Okay. See. I did. Yeah. Jump then move. Yeah. Even, it, but it's... that's a long jump, so. Yeah. You can do it though, but uh, yeah, you go. do have to make sure you jump and then or go. give yourself and then a... go cr- crouch. Ah, that's it, crouching. Oh, then... eight now. Don't touch him. No. Nope. <laughs> oh, not He's quite out. Now. You can try going to the right there. Yes, I don't think I've been there. Yet. Or did that open? Was that there before? Oh, oh we've been there. Ah. That's where we've been. Okay, we've we got we eight. Down? We need four more. Uh, nope, we've been down. Oh. Have we been down here, oh, But though? you should read them all. Oh, <gasps> look at that. Oh, good job. The Wheel Nine. of Faith. This looks hard. There we go. Is that just a... Ten. Place mark? Um, oh. Or it f- triggers something, maybe. Yeah, because it doesn't look like a normal... Oh, Back what? here. So two more? We need two more, yeah. Yep, twelve. Is that asthma? I thought it was just a hairball thing. No, it I, sounds like a hairball. It ball. sounds like a hairball, but it's actually asthma. He has like um it's like wheezing, but it's very like wet. Yeah. My poor bug. Is that door? Something open? triggers him. I'm not sure what, but we think he might actually just have allergies. Because it seems to get better Maybe. in the winter and worse in the and worse in the kind of springtime. Yeah. So, uh, uh, is that platform not working? <laughs> oh, it works. Okay. Oh, where are the last? Oh, there's one. What the hell? Not that one yet. There's I one. swear we've gotten that I one. I swear we have, but uh, that's okay. So we just need. Does it reappear? No. <laughs> it's possible. Uh, Possibly regenerates if you like flip switches. Yeah. I still don't know how to flip that switch, though. Hi. Oh. Oh. You okay, baby? Maybe I crawl. Nope. Jump. That could leap be. Leap of faith. Leap it's of a faith. Leap of faith. Maybe. This got to be. <gasps> nice. There we go. There we go. Oh. You went through that room before, but I guess. Oh. You're able to walk through it, but. I guess so. <gasps> Is this a pit? I have four lives. I'm gonna trigger that save point first. You okay? You okay? It's death. Mm-mm. Yep. Fire. Uh, the catnip, did it trigger it? No, yeah. he doesn't seem to be. Oh, oh, there's one. That should be your 12th. Oh, he's having trouble oh, again. <gasps> Uh-oh, don't die. Uh-huh. Oh, sweet cat. Is it gone? Oh, what? It's gone. What? Oh, my God. Where did it go? Where did it go? There it is. Okay, let's do it now. So there's some weirdnesses. Okay, okay. I didn't win the game, but let's go over to Satan now. <laughs> let's go over to the Satan room and pretend we're finishing the game. 
Oh, I don't think that was the leap of faith hit. I think it was the invisible path over a wood bridge. Oh, oh maybe. Okay. No, yeah, it's probably another leap of faith somewhere in there. I love the upside down guy. Yeah, it's great. Okay, we're in the final boss. I don't know how you win without weapons, but maybe those those flashing upside down crosses maybe, are the weapons. Maybe things appear and you jump and platform. Yeah. I don't know. And it's henchmen. <laughs> maybe that guy Satan! is a that guy's a placeholder for for Satan. Maybe. Yeah, that's quite possible. And I win the game. Yay! Yay there we go. Awesome. Really, really looking forward to this. I don't know what is preventing OCO the OCO team from moving forward on this one. Mm -hmm. um, good game. Yeah, thank you. Um, but it's really close. It seems like it's really close. Yes. Um, and he, uh, Mars did send me over the Dreamcast version of this. So oh. sometime in the future, we'll play the Dreamcast version of it. And, um, and maybe some other Dreamcast homebrew as well. Mm. That'd be fun. Okay, let's go on to game number three. <laughs> bow, 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 bow. <laughs> and game number three is Classic Kong Complete. Nice. Uh, by also OCO. The last three games are all by OCO. Because mm. I'm like, oh my god, you guys have a bunch of games. And I'm going to show them on the show. <laughs> they, they make J Lynx and Jaguar games. Um, this uh, game, Classic Kong Complete, plays first again in Silly Venture 2018 Atari Jaguar competition. It's actually a port of an SNES homebrew game. Okay, okay. Uh, made by Bubble Zap in 2012. Um, but it's very hard to find information about the SNES 2012 version. Okay. Or this game as well. It's just like Both nothing. Both hard to come There's by, yeah. <laughs> not hard to come by, but hard to come by the information. Like just nothing. Mm. There's just nothing written out, up about them. Um, but I do have a, a video of the SNES version. Or SNES, as people cringe to hear that word. SNES. It's just when you read it. It's, it's, it's all SNES. It's SNES. Um, so here is... Make sure the volume's not blasting people's. I'm just checking it off. Okay. Um. Yeah, he's he's alive. Good. Let's go past the title screen. There we go. So a very bubbly, cartoony, looking um, Donkey Kong. Snez is not a word. It's four separate letters. Yeah. Silly programmers not writing any documentation. I say this as a professional programmer. Probably more concerned about the game itself than uh, writing up how to play it, because obviously they, they know how to play it. I mean, also, it is Donkey Kong. Everybody knows how to play Donkey Kong. Avoid barrels, get to top. Avoid missing ball to win. <laughs> what is the Pong instructions? I gotta write that down. Avoid avoid missing for high score something like that okay and then it goes to the second screen and then it has a third screen all the classic donkey kong screens nice and then that a fourth really screen good. and that's it there we go so oh, what is that noise or is it the game yeah it must be the game okay uh, let's uh, load it up on the Jaguar and see how well they did. Avoid missing ball for high score. Yeah. That's what I'm going to say for instructions. <laughs> Anytime I don't have instructions for a game. Yeah. Avoid missing ball for high score. There go. Yes? I should make a t-shirt that says that. I bet there already is a t-shirt that says oh. that. Oh. Is he doing okay? He, was, he hid. I tried to give him oh. some Ventolin, but he ran into it. He's like, it. no, I don't yeah. want your stinky medicine. Poor cat. There you go. So if you want to load yeah. it up. Classic Kong complete. Hi. I, that's Hi, what floof. I needed. I needed a fluffy cat tail in my Look at face. this cat tail. Look at it. So floofy. Oh, my God. What is that tearing going on? Ooh. Hmm. So let's hope that it doesn't translate over to the game. 
Do -do 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 -do. There we go. Okay. 2012 Bubble Zap, 2018 OCO, Swap Do, Swap D0, and Mars. Press A, B, or C to start. Nice uh, background scrolling mm. on a shadowed city. Help me. Help me. Broken ladder. It's slow. Help oh. me. Well, scrolling in the background is uh, obviously meant for a CRT. Ah, I forgot about that. <laughs> no, no, definitely do <laughs> not wait on ladders. That. I haven't played this in a while. Japanese order of screens, yes. Yeah, the American order of screens repeats the screens over. The Japanese order is like one, two, three, four. Get all four levels. Yeah, you see that blip, blip, blip on the sides? Oh my god. If you watch a How am I supposed to get? Jump over. Or you can... Or wait till he gets past the ladder somehow. Um, what was I going to say? Oh, yeah. Oh, jump, jump, jump as soon as you can. Jump! Oh, my God. You were so lucky. So lucky. Yeah, very nice graphics. It looks like very good translation from the SNES version. Um, yeah, see that chunky weirdness on the sides? Um... You could see that a lot in NES games because the developers never thought that there would be anything but CRTs. Mm. And the CRTs cut off a lot of the borders. So, oh, where are you going? Up the oh, ladder. I have to go up the ladder. Yep. I just want more points. More points? Well, you can continue to uh, jump barrels. <laughs> Oh no, your princess is in another <laughs> castle. In another construction site. Oh no. <laughs> Help me. You start moving fast oh, and what? then you move super, super slow. Why is it level one again? Yeah. Want to get the hammer? Let's show off the hammer. Sure. Don't jump off the ledge. Jump straight up. And you jumped off the ledge. <laughs> oh. oh, you die. Oh, come on. Mario can take a fall of that height. It's like three feet. No, not in the old old uh, Mario uh, Brothers. Mario needs to work I'm Donkey on some Kong, I mean. knee and, and quad Why is this strength. game so so slow? It is really slow. At the, points, the moment you're just there's moving. the moment there are barrels on the screen, you move to a s crawl. Yeah. An absolute crawl. So it needs some optimization. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because the Jaguar can definitely handle six barrels moving and a background this needs needs some optimization I'm gonna turn it up a little bit in the studio is it gonna give you a warning is it gonna flash oh no it just disappears you were very lucky mm -hmm. that hammer needs to flash or something change colors because that's dangerous not enough bits in the old Jaguar. We gotta double the bits. Double the bits. We need 128. Help me. Help me. So you can make it to level two. I didn't I did make it to level two, so yeah. I don't know what happened there. It's weird. But we were watching the SNES version, not the Jaguar version, so. Maybe this is the Americanized? Maybe there's only one level. Maybe this is just a demo. It it said demo, didn't it? Did it? Yep, there's oh. just level one. My there you go, right. your turn. Ah, uh, run. Beat my score. <laughs> oh, you got 5,200. Because <laughs> <laughs> we were competing in a competition the other day, mm. and the scores were like 2,600 and 7,800. Oh, but that was after, funny. Afterwards, the, the, um, the person admitted that they did that on purpose. Of course they did. Um, then I eclipsed his score with a 20,000, oh my god, um, over the 7,800. And then at the last minute, he eclipsed my score with 30,000. <laughs> oh, game over. I'm going to try it again. Love help that the me. princess is screaming help. Yeah. This is a day one purchase if they fix the speed. Mm. Well, in and the next game, I'm going to, yeah, well, they'll <laughs> yeah. up all the levels. Yeah. It I'm going to tell good. you something that's going to sweeten even the pot for that. If you you buy it just for this, 
looks great. It does. It looks really, really nice. I love the cartoon graphics. Um, and the voice really helps. That's really cool. Go on, get up the ladder. Oh, nope. Nope. Okay, good. Oh, you're going to come down the ladder? Nope. Just I'm used to it being a little bit faster, so I it's jumped. It's very slow. I jumped too late when I died yeah. last time because I thought, oh, it's going to be faster, but the jump is, is just as slow as... Yeah, everything's, everything's in this. The barrel's going down crazy. Mm -hmm. There you go, barrel. Oh, I did it again. Yeah, as soon as the third barrel appears in the screen is when your speed drops, which is oh. what I noticed, too. You're moving fine, and then the third barrel comes along and then grinds. Look how fast One. you move. One, yeah. That's the normal speed. Yeah. Two. Three. Yeah, and it doesn't it get just, any slower. It just gets slow. It just gets slow, and it continues to be the same speed. Slow, slow speed. Yeah, because there's tons of barrels. I'm not great at Donkey Kong, by the way. Uh, it, That's why well, I keep dying. I, I can slow. only do well because it's moving so freaking slow. <laughs> the aesthetic makes me think of a Genesis port. Not that this yeah don't use the jazz. It doesn't use the Jaguar to good effect. Just in the choice of colors and design of the characters. Yeah. 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 Okay, let's just go up the ladder. Oh, oh, oh! It blanked out. Oh my god. It's gone. Anyway, we Oh, we're still playing somehow. Can you hear it? That's kind Funny. of uh <laughs> Next! Exactly. It's very creepy. Yeah, it when is. you just hear the princess screaming, screaming help in me. The dark. It does sound like he's beating her. <laughs> <laughs> Time for this ceremony. <laughs> invisible maze, yeah. Donkey Kong with an invisible maze. And James gave up. <laughs> In the dark? Yes. Oh, I'm gonna give up. that's so funny. Okay, the, the <laughs> fourth and last game is Burger Time, also by OCO. Mm. Uh, same uh, person for code as the last game. And graphics, same person. Swap D0 for code and uh, Marshall Devod. Mars for graphics. Uh, this is from December 7th, 2019. Okay. Uh, do I have anything to show for this one? No. Just things to say. Oh, let's switch it back to the Jaguar. Let's switch the cartridge. Boom. There you go. All right. Load it up. Burger time. So, uh, who said that they'd buy it? immediately um, um, let me tell you something um mars posted on december 26 2022 oh run at zero run yeah um the game as this game he's talking about this game has been finished for a long time and is part of a three-in-one game pack burger time which is going to be renamed renamed burger tom mm. by the way unfortunately the final build may sit on my hard disk forever but this says burger time that's why i called it burger you can go to credits, but it doesn't work. No credits. Credits are at the bottom. Uh, go to instructions. More like a demo. Yep. We'll see what this does. Don't get something. Um, user you hate it posted after when I was playtesting this and sending fines and issues to swap do uh, two years ago back in late 2020. I'd mentioned this would be part of a combo cart uh, with classic Kong. So this game and Classic Kong are going to, be, going to be on the same cartridge, and a game called Xmas Craze, okay. which I'm unfamiliar with. I may look that up. Maybe it's not been shown yet. And uh, yep, yeah, and it'll be renamed Burger Tom. So that really wasn't instructions, more like uh, a demo. Yeah, very nice title screen. With the movement. They just need to uh, either chop it off or fix up the sides for us non-CRT. Users. <laughs> um, yeah, do one. Nice. Run. Oh, yeah. You move nope. really fast. Yeah. Power. Carolyn's an expert at this. Is he uh, good? He was just destroying it last time we played a Burger Time on the show. Remember how to play? You have to 
trap the guys. Yeah, I know. And it's even better to have them walk on it. Yeah. I or know. no, no. Is it walk is better? Yeah, when they fall off of it. Yeah. Get that ice cream for more pepper. Remember you have pepper too. Oh, I always forget the pepper. Yeah. Holy wow, he's fast. He has his turbo I burger time. I like it. Burger time turbo two. Burger time two turbo. It sounds like doggy barking, doesn't it? A little bit. Roo, roo. Roo, roo. Get that, get it. Huh? Ah. Ah, go to the left! Oh my god! <laughs> Control issues. Oh, 100% me, but... What? Go, man. It just wasn't quite at the... Yeah, that's always a, um, a struggle with games is that how much leeway do you give the player for a ladder? Do you give them a lot of leeway? Do they have to be pixel perfect? Early games back in the day is like, no, you have to be pixel perfect. If you're not aligned within one pixel, you can't do the ladder. That's interesting. Oh, oh pepper, 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 pepper. Oh, which one? Always be in a, uh, the, the default is B on Jaguar. Okay. Because it's like the middle button. It's the one you put your finger on because you move to the other ones, right? If you're fast and the enemies are still slow, it's cheating. <laughs> this leaves Kong and it's dust. Yeah, yeah see, they ah. can... Peppers. There you go. It's well peppered. Ooh, ooh. If you ever need a dog barking sound effect, this is the game. Ah. Ah. Out of the way. It's a pretty long. Mm. It's a pretty long. Um, what was I going to say? Um, Water? Pepper. It is a very long pepper. Wait, wait. Oh, yeah, wait for them to come up. And now. Yes. Well, that guy wasn't even on it. Haha, <laughs> I got him. See, that, it's, that's what you want. Gotcha. You want them on it. And then it goes down to the bottom. The enemies seem to follow the original patterns pretty well. Yeah, they're very faithful to the patterns. Oh. Nice pepper. Wait for it. Uh, wait for it. Uh, no, I want to finish it. No, it's guys, faster. These it's guys faster when they're on it. They freak me out. <laughs> I've always, even as a kid, like the commercial, we were talking about the commercial oh, for Burger freaky. Time, yeah. just kind of terrified me. Well, there are things in huge food suits in the commercial. It's so creepy. This guy running around a kitchen with, in the kitchen's on fire? Was the kitchen on fire? Oh, something like that. And he's like... Ugh, didn't shoot him right now. And, if he, and I think we discussed this last time. It, like, this guy is walking on the burgers. <laughs> you do not want... Footlights. <laughs> You just do not want fun You have to wait for the burger to calm down. That's funny. Yeah, yeah. Goes bloop, bloop, bloop. Then you win. Out of pepper. Out of pepper. Uh, is she? Uh, I am. Does that indicate the level it's or the, the pepper? It's at the oh, top. Oh, there it is. Okay. Oh, my goodness. Oh, I love the, oh, the flashing. Oh, it's flipping around. Um, everything has two yeah. frames of animation, so it looks like it's going on and off and flickering, but it's actually, are they, uh, pickles, yes, run, I'd buy the three-in-one cart just for this game, oh god, two cats with asthma, why are you, why are you coughing, what's going on, it's bright, is he, is, is he, Cat. What's happening? Baby. Okay. Come here. Come here. What's wrong with you? Does he have a hairball? He might. Might have eaten something or. Yeah, oh, you can. Oh, he's a poor little guy. Oh my goodness. Maybe 
need something in the house. Maybe something in the house. Do some more research on cat as well. She's looking at, she's looking at Atari going, you do this to me. What is up with these kitties? There's something in the house causing me problems. Oh, I don't have pepper. Okay, <laughs> buddy. It says no. What was that? Oh. I don't understand what's happening to me. Come here, cuddles. Poor kitties. Poor kitties. Get some cuddles. Out of pepper. You can do it. You can do it. Oh, not like that. <laughs> oh, why are they going the other way? That's really weird. Wait for it. Wait for it. Now! Send them down! They're funny. They don't... Oh. So, if you notice, their pattern is down, right, down, right, down, right, Always. up, left, up. They go zigzag. Yeah. So you can use that to your advantage to know where they're going to go. Squish. If you kill them, I believe they always come out of the top right. Pepper from oh my god. Sorry, I panicked you. Oh, yes. you need that pepper now. Oh, too late. My oh, nice. Cute. Drop three levels with only one enemy on top. Mm. Yeah, I think that's too far, isn't it? Or maybe not. What are you guys eating and getting asthma? I don't know if it's eating. Something is bugging me. Only be two levels. Oh, yeah, maybe. Mm. It, it maybe there's maybe we're on like that easy one. mode or something because he moves really fast too. Could be. I mean, this isn't done. So, Ice so cream. Logic might be. Ice cream. Get them all at once. Catch them all. You had a cat with his kind of fur before. Ours does that thing too. I really just think it's a super long, super cottony fur. I've had longish hair cats that didn't do it much, but their fur was different. It's not him, it's actually um, Atari gets most of the asthma. But it is definitely asthma. We've taken him yeah. to the vet for it and um, he has he has like a steroid to help him um Get better. Yeah, get over it. and it has it gotten is helping. better. He used but... to have like three or four attacks a day. Yeah. And now it's one attack every. It, it did get worse week. when we had like um, air freshener in the house. Yes. Um, and then when we stopped, like like we used to have the one that you plug into the wall. Oh, when we bad. stopped that, it immediately started to get better. So there was there are definitely things that trigger him. Like, poor guy. He walked right through that sausage. Uh, because he's, he's kind of stunned. He's yeah. like, uh oh, what just happened? Totally stunned. I don't know why this makes me want a burger. Well, burgers are tasty. They are tasty. Oh my god. Come on. No. There we go. It brings it all the way down. Can I make it here? Okay. You sausage, you. Yes. That's what I want. Papa. Yay, 
Oh, jump. can I get it? Nope, not enough time. Nope. Oh, I think it ended with one life symbol. It did. It's one of those games. Mm. One of those games, yep, where your life is the one that's showing. thinking of making up like a... An, why is he going in a circle? Come over here. There you go. Like a best practices for, for games. <laughs> that's on the list. Is if Couch we, compliance. Couch Number compliance. One. Well, that's that's very 2600 kind of specific, but uh, <laughs> that can be a good one. Oh my god. Oh, what is he climbing up? Oh, he's going into heaven. Ah! <laughs> Where is he, he going to show up? Burger Heaven. I, oh my oh, goodness. Oh, something's wrong. I can't get past here. It's, it's all crazy. Time. Yum, yum, oh, yum, yum. Oh, it's treat time. Oh, thank you, Dan ABC. Oh, something's crazy with this game. Yeah? Well, you're going to have to start stop for treat time anyway. No, I can't stop for treat time. <laughs> I've got nine peppers, but I'll switch over to treat time. Let me get in a safe spot. Oh, I have to do the scores too. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Oh, is there You're a pause? You're gonna have to. Is there a pause? It doesn't work. Oh no. Is Option? there a pause on there? Yeah. No, it's not like they put it all on the controller, which is great. Um, which is the way to Oh my kittens. It's like you're being tortured. Yeah. I'm being tortured with lack of treats. Lack of treats is torture. <laughs> it's my, my B-Day treats for the cat. Oh, well, happy birthday, Who Dan. Dan triggered it? Dan did, and it's his birthday. Oh, happy, happy birthday, birthday Dan. Dan. The cats are here to celebrate they're with you, and oh, thank They're you. so happy. They are happy. For your birthday. Can you talk to them? They're so happy. They're, they're singing you happy birthday as we speak. Well, the black kitten is. One of yeah, you're gonna have to pause. You're gonna have I can't to die. Pause. I don't want to die. I'm on level three, I think. It's not that big of an accomplishment. But... Okay, which way are you going? Ah, no. It doesn't pause at the beginning of the next level, does it? I don't it just think starts right away. Any pausing at all. Oh, I could have seen. Okay. Jaguar pause isn't hardware based. It has to be programmed into each game. Uh, apparently so. Because it's it's just a button, which no, is great. It starts automatically. Oh, um, but I want to. It's slow. On this. Ooh, it's a little chunky slow on this. Yeah. Um. Okay. What are we gonna do here? Can I do the score or? Uh, technically. Can I sit to the right of you and we s switch spots? Oh. Uh, you can handle all of it. So I don't know if I can, but I can yeah. try. So what am I clicking on the right there? Okay. Just the plus ones. Okay. The add points. That one. You've got a cat under your butt there, so. Okay, cats. I have to wait for cats. Oh my cats. Okay, ding, ding, that's ding, one ding. inch. That's one inch. Sorry, I have to get ready. I, I know. I get it. I get it. point before I give you the treat, just so you're aware, guys. <laughs> That's probably the best Gonna part. give them some advantages, I think. Oh, uh, well, if you do it evenly, they shouldn't. Oh, oh, almost, almost. Atari, you didn't, the bell didn't ring, buddy. <laughs> <laughs> He's like looking at my hand. More I ring rang it, give me ring treats. Ring the bell, ring it. Ring the bells. No, you can't get any. Ring the bell, ring the bell. Bells. Atari. Oh, a little harder. Oh. Okay, Sprite got one there. Atari! Good, good Atari cat. Oh, the door needs closing. Atari is... Sorry, pause, pause. Two points. Atari's winning? Oh! Oh my goodness! Okay, you get two points now. There's you can, one for Atari. You can subtract points too. I, I know, but I don't. <laughs> it's too chaotic. Oh, another. Cat chaos. Cat chaos. Confu getting confused with what that is too. Okay, it's Atari. Too hard, they're too close. 
Five four. Four sprite. Six four for sprite. You're high from catnip, that's yeah. why you can't keep trying. Oh, do it! It's hurting, buddy! Oh, oh, we almost! There we go! Good, it's hard cat! Sprite! Oh, my Atari's on the game! Wow, it's the catnip! He had catnip last time before his, uh, before his turn and did well. I don't know what's going on. Oh. Was still just slightly ahead. Treats now. Game point. I finish? Yes. Oh! Huge ass says, looks like he was finished and got the burger time license. Uh, not that I'm aware of. Last I read. They, All right. I, as of today, he, I believe he said when I when I posted that we're gonna play this game, he, it was changed to Burger Tom. So I don't think there's any licensing. Yet. All right. Well, it All looks right. like. All right. Sprite one. Oh, oh. Sprite one. But ten, ten to nine. nine. I mean, Atari. I gave him an extra point right at the end. Game point for Sprite. Correct. Why you come up the ladder? Why didn't you? Oh, because I'm straight up the ladder. Are you choking? Uh, yeah. It's probably got it stuck in a tube. Oh. You okay, buddy? I'm having issues today. Alright, he's not choking. Uh, maybe open the door again? It's hot. What are you doing? Buddy, where is <laughs> Cat issues today. Cat issues. Gotta go way up here. Come on, Aggie. Oh god. Oh, I didn't finish it. Go up. Ooh, can I get it still with that on it? Yes. There we go. Go up. Yes. Okay. Perfect. That's what I wanted. Guys, get in your face. Hello. Just manually. And that's it. Wait for them to jiggle and finish. You still have to protect yourself. It's like uh, I'm playing. Um... Oh God, this. Get moving immediately. I'm I'm playing Cuphead right now, and on some of the bosses. Even if you defeat the boss, there's still like a couple seconds sometimes where you can die. Still while, um, so you're still vulnerable even though you defeated the boss. That's how it is in this game too. This is pepper level. So is many it? dead ends in this one. Oh, those are the worst. Oh, I like how he has like red eyes. Oh, he's all, his it's eyes like, are sore. It's like he's, he's been pepper sprayed. Yeah, well, yeah. Literally? Literally. Oh, God. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, God. Um, should I just die? Yeah. I don't know what's up with the black Well, maybe guy. I shouldn't have died. I think he's dealing with a bit of a hairball. I mean, that's what's yeah. going on. Yeah. Okay. He's having issues. Yeah. Oh, thank you. Poor little guys. This one's full of dead ends. This is where you lose all your lives. Get him! Oh, ho, ho, nice. Smoosh. Why is that falling? There we go. Graphical error in that one. A little bit. Go down. Go down all the way. There we go. Let's do that side. Egg, okay, go. No! Oh, run! Okay, pickle, go. Oh, where is it? I can finish this off if I get. One guy? Two guys? Three guys? Four guys? Oh, good. Okay, jiggle. Jiggle. Finish jiggling. 
Finish the level. Math is for nerds. <laughs> oh, we're back to level one. Is this level one? Is this level one? I think it is. It looks a bit like the one. Are you moving faster? Yeah. Are you okay, buddy? Issue. Issues. Show today. me your mouth. Mm, no, he's like, no. <laughs> no, no, mom. mom. Don't look at my mouth. You're embarrassing mouth. me on stream, mom. <laughs> oh. No. <laughs> well, he's not happy. Annoyed with me, maybe. Annoyed with me. Today, fragile both of you. little cat. They are fragile little babies. Little fur babies. <laughs> Although one of them did take a big bite out of your toe, so I could never wrap my head around the logic, other than the designers were high with the munchies <laughs> of this game. Yeah, are oh, the burgers yeah. enormous or is the chef tiny? <laughs> this would make more sense as a ratatouille game. Why oh, are the pickles yes. sentient, but lettuce is not? <laughs> What's a punch. hot dog doing there? <laughs> it's not a hot dog. It's a sausage. I swear oh, it's it a is. sausage. It is. it is a sausage. Um, that's true. It's not a burger topping. It's not. That's why they're not Eggs, in the burgers. Possibly. Possibly. Pickles, possibly. Definitely pickles. Pickles are very um, good. I like how when you spray the egg with pepper, it turns green like it's gone off. <laughs> um... <laughs> Okay, I've wrapped this around, and I still have three lives. Um, not that I'm so close to that. But I'm not terrible. <laughs> I mean, you could put sausage on the burger. Oh, I, sure. I wouldn't be against that. Sure. Just, you know, oh, God. Ah. I like how it turns into an avocado. Um, kind of a very ooh, yellow avocado. There's a missed opportunity to make fun of millennials. You could have a burger time that's called avocado toast time. <laughs> avocado toast time. <laughs> And it's you know, just avocado you could have sandwiches. some, uh, oh. it's avocado, um, maybe a little bit of um, uh, feta cheese, um, some microgreens, um, uh, 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 heirloom tomatoes. There you go. Sponsored by Impossible Burger. <laughs> Vegetables only belong on a burger in liquid condiment form, says BBG Double Town. <laughs> this is another example where. I was terrible at Burger Time. Yeah. Before playing it on the it's show. It's a pretty hard game until you get used to the patterns. It's all about the patterns. Yeah. I kind of felt that way. I was never a very good Pac-Man player and I used to get frustrated with it, so I never played it very much. Yeah. And then um, we played a lot of Pac-Man. Thank you, Pac-Man Plus. Um, and then all of a sudden I'm like, oh, I this think I like this it. game. This is a fun game. That's happened a lot of times yeah. to a lot of games yeah. after we play them on the show. I'm like, oh, I actually like this game now. It's really good. Because you're you're forced to play it. You're forced to learn the rules. You're forced to understand everything about the game. And you're like, oh, that's why I keep failing when I play it. Or you watch a few videos of other people playing yes. it, and you're like, oh, they make it look easy, which it, it is not, but... You do get some tips when you watch people play. Oh, I mean, that's I, that's what's so cool about gamer culture and Twitch is that you can learn a lot about how to play a game by watching a few videos or watching some live stream streams of people yes. who know how to play the game play it. So we need a new port of Qbert for Tanya. I'm better at Qbert now than I ever have been, to be honest. <laughs> um, Captain N played Burger Time. Love a burger with a Friday in there. Mega Man was a pickle. <laughs> what? Mega Man was a pickle. I don't know how to dissect that. <laughs> oh, one that doesn't use diagonals. Yeah, I would appreciate that. Well, I played just... it. I played it at the arcade when we were there because they had a version of it. That's. And I quite helps. enjoyed it because it's already it's got the set to the it's got diagonals. Four way, forty five degree yeah. joystick. Which just feels better somehow. Well, it does. It's, yeah. it's hard. It's, it's hard to kind of wrap your head around yeah. a normal joystick and kind of rotating it a bit. Yeah. And also, eight-way oh, joysticks went. don't translate. Oh, just left, and they're all like, "Let's hang around the burger top." Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Is that it? Oh Yay! my god! Just... The wiggles take a little bit. I'm like, yeah. "Oh my god! Hurry up, burger, settle." Okay, I think we have to stop. 
Because <laughs> I have two lives and okay. up to level 10. Yeah. Very good, very good uh, version of Burger Time. It does have a slight bit of slowdown, which I'm sure they'll address for the final uh, version of the game. Um, but it plays really well. It adheres to the rules, mostly. I think the burger dropping might have a bit of issues, but uh, anyway. Uh, so, there we go. That's it. We have to turn this off. Okay. <laughs> I'm dying. Dead. Oh, using up all my lives. Using up your lives. Excellent. Okay. Okay. It's too much fun. It's too much fun. It is a lot of fun. It's a great, excellent. So that's going to be released as a three pack mm. sometime in the future. Nice. Um... Kong, what did what they call it? Something Kong Classic? Kong Classic? Um, classic Kong Complete. Plus, yeah, somebody mentioned that in the forums. Didn't they have Could you a... put Bob's Burgers in it? And then oh. be like, well, now you're fighting two IPs? That's going to yeah. be a problem. <laughs> burger Time and Bob's Burgers? Oh, that'd be so good. Didn't yeah. they, Wasn't there a Burger Time reference in a Bob's Burgers once? I swear there was. Or oh. in a commercial. FYI, one order of secret PCB shipped today. Awesome. Mm. That's excellent. Yeah. Secret to be revealed mm. in a future episode. Mm. Can't wait. Oh my God, I can't wait. It's going to be so good. Um, yeah, so uh, Burger Tom, classic Kong Complete. Okay. Plus a game called Xmas Craze. I'm going to look that up right now. See if there's any details on Xmas Craze for Jaguar. Xmas Craze Jaguar. Uh, nope. <laughs> Maybe a yeah. You always have to put Atari Jaguar because Jaguar is like a word. Uh, nope. I think I'm gonna have to put Xmas Craze in quotes. Nope. So there's nothing. On Xmas Craze on the internet right now, so that's going to mm. be a mystery game. Mm. But the wording of it's probably going to be sitting on my hard drive forever. The final version is kind of a bit worrying, so I might have to mm. ask Mars or Mars if you're watching. <laughs> more details, please. Yeah. On like yeah. why you can't release these games. They're, They're very cool. Very good. Mm -hmm. Yep. Um, so today we played Jalaga. Absolutely stunning. Mm -hmm. Beautiful three uh, level demo. Excellent. It'll probably be a while. But still. there's a lot to add to it. But very, still. very cool. Absolutely very, very amazing. Cool. Such a great alternative mm -hmm. port reimagining of Galaga because mm -hmm. it's quite different. It just has the basics of Galaga and everything else is rearranged. Uh, La Baie de Moore. Yeah. Very nice. It looks really good. Looks really, really amazing. good. Amazing. It doesn't yeah. look like there's much to do. No. I mean, it does need music. Yep. Some collisions, some animation. There's some temporary graphics in there, it looks like. Mm -hmm. But that's pretty close to done ish. It's hard to tell because we haven't played a real version of it, mm -hmm. a finished version. Mm -hmm. uh, there might be a lot of more complexity that we're missing, but it looks like it's done. Classic Kong. Looks absolutely great. <laughs> yeah. It plays, it's fun. Yeah. Um, the cartoony look to it is really good. Mm -hmm. um, the sound, the voices in it, that's really cool. Mm -hmm. And Burger Time, Burger Tom, plays great. Mm -hmm. Really good. Uh, super fun. Uh, yes, great games today. It's under Christmas Craze. Oh, okay. He typed it as Xmas, but that was probably just because he uh, short didn't want to type it all out. Yeah. There it is. So it is downloadable. Oh. Okay, so... Oh, no, it's not downloadable. It would came second. Let me just put it on the screen for everyone. So according to um, DemoZoo website, it came second in the Silly Venture 2018 game competition. It doesn't have any downloads here. So it was shown off somewhere. Oh, there's some... Oh, it looks like a platformer. Okay, oh, nice. okay. Is this it though? 16-bit Christmas craze. That may not be the same. 
It looks like it's the same. Collect the presents, avoid the bad guys. What is this? What is this page? 16 bit. Oh, no. Not the same one. Uh, I think this is for a different different system, but I bet it's they're 40 porting bits it. 48 bits short. <laughs> 48 bits short. Um, but I bet that's the game they're porting because also um, Shiru, mm. I believe, made the other two games. Mm. And those were ports from another system. Ooh, I don't want to say yeah, that for sure. Oops. Yeah, Christmas Craze from SNES. Okay. Um, no, go away. Go away. Go away. Go away. <laughs> but it's not respecting Jaguar or Atari. So let's put Jaguar in there. In quotes. But of course there's pages with like, oh, Jaguar down the side yeah, and stuff. Yeah, it's always hard. I can't find Searches anything. don't, yeah. Just that one page. Yeah. That's it. Uh, mm. Right here. Under games that uh, Mars has made. And apparently it was in a competition in Silly Venture 2018. How about I do that? Christmas craze. Of course it comes up with that. And a results page. That's not going to help too much <laughs> that's just gonna be the results nice yeah old bbs looking uh, mm -hmm. uh that's it yeah oh atari online.pl that might oh this is just results again of the competition there's christmas craze they put cr classic kong in the same competition oh. they beat themselves oh funny <laughs> that is it funny. came in first and second mm. I don't know if it was posted anywhere. Mm. Ooh, YouTube. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'll have to get rid of Silly Venture. Jaguar. Videos. Oh, let's just go to YouTube. Sometimes that is easier. Uh, just going to switch away just for a second. <laughs> just in case. All, oh, yeah. Even though all I watch is pretty much uh, uh, video game stuff. Hardware <laughs> fixes. Hardware fixes. Ooh. Ooh, it's another one hour video of someone... Uh, <laughs> soldering. Soldering. <laughs> soldering and desoldering. <laughs> That's everything. Ooh, it's a desoldering gun. <laughs> Mixing it up <laughs> today. <laughs> no, it's, it's not on YouTube. It's just nothing. Surprisingly, I don't watch a lot of makeup tutorials. No, you watch crafting stuff. I do watch a lot of crafting stuff. I'm not stuff. super keen on that. No, no. Uh, what, what was it? What was the competition it was in? Silly Venture. Mm. Oh, you meant James. Yeah, he does. He does watch a lot of makeup tutorials. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I love it. Oh. I love it. Oh, somebody sent me. A video. Anyway, we'll have to switch back. See if it's see if it's relevant or if it's just something irrelevant. Nope, not relevant to our discussion. Okay, <laughs> so that's uh, that's it. Nothing on YouTube. I can't find anything. It does exist under Christmas craze. It did enter into a competition. Yeah. Okay. But there's no video and no download for okay. it. So maybe they're saving it for Until the it's cartridge. At a certain, uh, yeah. 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 Or it's at a certain level. Yeah, yeah. fair enough. So, yeah. uh, lots of fun games today. Thank you so much for tuning in. Mm -hmm. uh, what do we have coming up? Actually, we do have something coming up that I haven't talked about yet. Really? Because this is the first stream since I added it to the list. Oh. I think. Is um, it on the list? Is it what? Is it exciting? I don't know. Is it on the list? Where is it? There we go. 
Um, here we go. So, uh, June 23rd, we have an exclusive work in progress update Ooh, nice. to Turbo Arcade awesome. from Champ Games. Mm -hmm. It is absolutely completely reworked. Reworked? From last time. Really? The updates are astounding oh, to it. Oh, good. He, has, he sent over a list of the updates and I'm like, wow. oh my God. Okay. <laughs> That's big. That's really big. Um, so we will have the exclusive um, re-premiere of uh, Turbo Arcade mm. on the 23rd, June 23rd. And uh, so that's going to be a lot of fun. What day is that? That is a noon. So it's going to be Darcy or Erlen. Excellent. Um, that'll be a lot of fun. Does it use a shift lever yet? I believe it does. Really? Yes. Oh my goodness! That's I'm gonna break complex out, for me. I'm gonna break out my foot pedals. For oh it too. my goodness! I want to. I don't want to reveal all this stuff in it. Wow. So we'll save it for the show. But a lot of new stuff has been packed into this. Okay. okay. A lot of new tech. A lot of new other things. <laughs> I can't say because it'll give it away. Anyway, next episode is gonna be June sixteenth. Uh, this Friday. Mm -hmm. It's scheduled to be Erlen. Uh, it's gonna be an Atari twenty six hundred day. We're gonna be playing role play. And Space Instigators 20th Anniversary Edition, and at least one more game as well. We'll see what uh, pops up mm -hmm. in the forums or elsewhere. I'll dig in the archives for something I've been wanting to play. And uh, then maybe a Lynx Day after that. We're going to be playing a game called Nutmeg um, and some other Lynx games as well. Um, and we'll probably be doing Gravitic Mines sooner than later. We need to do, put some levels in and finish that off really soon. Oh, yeah. We've been neglecting that. Yeah, we badly. have. We have. We do need to. Um, Jaguar Rotary Controller Special Part 2. Mm. I've got to schedule that in somewhere. I've got some 2B Determines coming up at the end of June, so I might put that in there. From what I heard, Turbo Arcade still won't work on Harmony Encore and least the modules. Yes, that is still true. Um, it is a big game. Mm. You will need the modules for that. So I guess watch out for the modules. Cool. I mean, it's not ready to be released yet anyway. No. You, it's got a bit of... If he releases an updated demo, you'll be able to play it, I think, yeah. in Stella? Maybe not. I don't yeah. remember if the original one you could play in Stella. Ooh. Did it release a demo for the first one? Maybe not. I don't know. It's hard mm. to keep track. Um, what are those things? <laughs> It's a cookie? Render rendered 42 ghost cookie? cookie. <laughs> rendered ghost cookie? Wait, it's a rendered ghost oh, with a, a cookie. Oh, it is. <laughs> with a heart. That's funny. Oh, uh, I do like cookies. Yeah, cookies yeah. are good. We haven't had cookies. Well, we do have cookies upstairs. I make cookie, uh, I eat cookies oh, at work all the time. <laughs> yeah, I see it pop up. Yeah, oh, my coffee it. and cookie. Uh, yeah, um, daily cookie. Yeah, mm. obsession. <laughs> uh, Fascination. So lots of great stuff coming up on the show. Mm -hmm. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Rendered Ghost, Dan, AVC, VVG Double Down, mm -hmm. uh, Gamma Dev, Hugh Jass, Nostalgic, uh, RC70, Cyrano J from Reboot, um, Neo Media, mm -hmm. uh, Dan, AVC, I know you said. Carl G. Lots of people jumping in and out. Yeah. Um, Ivory Tower Spencer, Collections, yeah. Alna Fur, Rod Kassler, excellent, and everybody else Yay. who chatted earlier Kissing than that, now. and all the lurkers as well. And yes, everybody on YouTube, you. hi, if you're still sticking around, <laughs> make sure you subscribe on YouTube or follow us on Twitch. Yes, it's, you can do it, no problem, and it'll mm -hmm. alert you when new shows are posted or mm -hmm. we're going live. You never know when an After Dark pops up. That's right. Sometimes they're not even scheduled. We're just like, oh, it's time to do an After Dark. We have some couple hours. Yeah. Um, so that's it. Uh, have a great week and, uh, we'll be back on Friday with mm -hmm. Erlen with some great new or great Atari homebrews. It may not be new, <laughs> new to me. So we will see you, uh, next time on Friday. Yes. Bye everyone. Bye.